Thanks for tuning in once again to WSKI Channel 17 Weather Report, brought to you by Geppetto's, found in Sugarloaf's Village West. I hope you got out this morning because the turns were awesome. Uh, that dense snow out there may not have been as much as the last storm, but it definitely felt like it. I call it hero snow where you can turn on it with uh, the great groomers underneath. Uh, the whole mountain did a great job last night making sure that the, this morning's runs were spectacular. It's college fest up here this week. Uh, we have events this evening as well as tomorrow night. And uh, Friday is looking like we're going to have some uh, partly sunny skies, cooler temperatures, but the wind should be pretty mellow as well. So it's going to be another beautiful day leading into the weekend. You can see partly sunny skies are going to continue into Saturday. Uh, the highs around 16, the lows just above zero. Um, and then we may have flurries Saturday evening into Sunday, looking temperatures to be in the low teens. Uh, as well as uh, lows down around zero, Monday should be a little cooler. Tomorrow we have 128 trails and trail sections available for you. 49 of those trails will be groomed this evening. Uh, it's looking like powder and packed powder, uh, machine groomed conditions out there. Uh, hopefully tomorrow, Skidway, King Pine, and Whiffletree will be back online. Uh, the groomers are looking at uh, Timberline, Bridal Chain, Tote Road, Spur Line, King's Landing, Hayburner, Narrow Gauge, and Lower Spillway. Sluice, Lower Gondola Line, Wedge, Lower Winter's Way, Candy Side, Boardwalk, The Landing, Birches, and the Snowbrook. On the east side, we're looking at Widowmaker, Ram Down, Lower Boomauger, Two Hall, Whiffletree, Roller, Slasher, uh, Scoot, Lower Windrow, Good Chance on the west side, and Haywire is going well uh, for terrain parks. You'll see at 8.30 a.m. we'll have Snubber, Sawduster, and potentially Skidway at 8.30 a.m., which will provide access to the Base Lodge area as well as a beginner terrain down there and give you access also to Whiffletree potentially at 9 a.m. And you'll see 8.30 a.m. Uh, DRCB, Super Quad, and Skyline will be running as well. Due to that power uh, outage the other day, the mountain is getting back on track and uh, should be providing those services as well as the Base Lodge power sh shortly. Uh, King Pine will be joining Timberline at 9 a.m., and uh, providing access to more uh, experienced terrain from towards the summit and the east side of the mountain. Down at the outdoor center, uh, grooming is uh, you know likely as well this evening. This new snow should create a nice conditions out there for your 75 kilometers of cross country skiing, as well as some snowshoeing and uh, skate and classic uh, groomed terrain. We have the ice ho hockey rink open available as well. Uh, the Arnold Trail Snowmobile Club. We'll be grooming uh, throughout the day as well as at night, so make sure you're careful out on the snowmobile and the Stratton and the Rangeley areas as well as Eustace, um, and make sure you stay to the right side and ride safely. And coming up in about two weekends, we'll have Martin Luther King Weekend offering uh, Watch and Win Friday evening, Saturday morning and evening, as well as Sunday morning and evening. Remember those shows are at 7.30 a.m. to 9 a.m. and then 5.30 p.m. to 7 p.m. where you can call in and win a grand prize of Outdoor Research Heated Gloves. Uh, as always, you can check us out on WSKITV.com, where you can find a real-time live video from the quad cam as well as a time-lapse. Or you can check us out on Facebook at Facebook.com forward slash WSKITV, on Twitter at Twitter.com forward slash WSKITV17, and on Instagram at WSKITV. Uh, WSKI has been owned and operated by Snowfields Productions since 1986.